Hello friends, how are you? Once again I welcome you all to your own channel JK Vision. Today, the country we are going to tell you about is considered to be the safest country after being a neighboring country of countries like Syria and Israel. Even after being an Arab country, it is neither a desert nor a camel. This country is considered to be one of the oldest countries in the world. And in almost every old book, this country has been mentioned. The nightlife here is considered to be the most different. While in this country, there is such a sky bar, which has been selected as the best sky bar in the world three times in a row. In this country, a lot of tradition is followed. Yes friends, we are talking about the beautiful country of Lebanon. So see what a seat belt you wear and go on a great journey to Lebanon. Lebanon is officially called the Lebanese Kingdom of Ghana. It is located in the east of Asia to the east of the Mediterranean Sea. Friends, this country is very beautiful. And if we talk about the night, no country can compete with the beauty of Lebanon at this time. Because the country does not feel less than a paradise at night. The borders of Lebanon are from Israel in the south and Syria in the north and east. You all know about Syria and Israel. There are attacks in Syria every day. And this is the reason why everyone is afraid to travel in Lebanon. The area of Lebanon is 10,452 kilometers. While the population here is about 68 million. One special thing about Arab countries is that you can see deserts and camels everywhere. But in Lebanon, you do not get to see anything like this. Friends, the whole world considers Lebanon as the most different country. But at the same time, the people of this country believe that no country can. The people of this country believe that God is above this country. And the people of Lebanon believe that Jesus did his first miracle in this country. Many people must have heard the name Lebanon before. But not many people know about this country. The name of Lebanon is on the list of countries in the world that is considered the oldest in the world. For your information, the name of Lebanon has not changed even once in more than 4000 years. Lebanon is a beautiful country and also a happy country. The lifestyle of the people here is quite different. Everyone who lives here likes to live a luxurious life. Although Lebanon is in the Middle East, but the lifestyle here is similar too. But friends, have you ever thought that where does Lebanon get so much money? From? So the country is small, but people come here to spend money. So friends, let me tell you that Lebanon has a gold mine, which makes the people of this country the richest. Jewelry made here is exported all over the world. Now, the country where there is a gold mine, the country must be rich. Friends, now let me tell you about Beirut, which is the capital of Lebanon and also the largest city here. This city is considered the pride of Lebanon. Beirut is one of the oldest cities in the world. It was established more than 5,000 years ago. In 2014, Lebanon became the most visited country and the most tourists came to. In this regard, this city has also left New York behind. 10% of Lebanon's economy comes from tourists coming to Beirut. Because the specialty of this city is something like this. One special thing about Beirut is that this city is also considered the center of Lebanon's culture, politics, economy and tourism. The population of this city is estimated to be around 10 million. For tourists, Beirut, the capital of Lebanon, is considered a very popular place. Such as the museum here and the beach here. Beirut's beaches are considered one of the westernmost beaches in the world. It is said that this city does not sleep all night. If you go here in the middle of the night, you will see noise everywhere. You will be surprised to know that this city was destroyed seven times in. But every time this city has risen with a different beauty and has come in front of people. Today this city is counted among the top 10 shopping destinations in the world. Lebanon's nightlife is different, because of which the Lebanese sky bar has. Friends, although Lebanon is known as an Arab country, but when it comes to their food, this country is not much behind us. Just as spices are put in the food of our country, Lebanon is also used in the food of the country. Here, sesame, kabuli chickpeas, green vegetables and grains are preferred. Lebanon's food is considered one of the oldest traditions in the world. People living in India are very fond of shawarma. People get ready at any time to eat this dish. But do you know that its roots are connected to Lebanon? And this shawarma is made the most delicious. If you like goat meat, then there is no better place for you than Lebanon. Because the goat meat of this country is considered the best. 
Such a dish is made by burying it in the ground. If you go to Lebanon, be sure to try goat meat. Friends, the people of Lebanon are of a different opinion. People here like to wear blazers the most, whether it is a boy or a girl. In Lebanon, 8 out of 10 people will see you in a blazer. Lebanon is the first Arab country to give its people the freedom to listen to radio and watch television for the first time. The freedom given to the women of this country has not been given to the women of any other Arab country. At present, Lebanon is 60% Muslim and 40% Christian. Arabic is the official language in Lebanon, but French, German, English and Armenian are also spoken here. Promotion of Islam, the Muslim population increased. In this country, a lot of tradition is followed. The people of Lebanon believe in good and bad a lot. Like friends, if a person in Lebanon starts a new business, buys a car or does any good work, the people here first find a wooden thing and knock on it. Lebanon has another unique tradition. Like if you go to a Lebanese family's house for tea or coffee, you have to leave a layer of tea or coffee in the cup. Like usually, the value of the email is known as the value of the cup. And it works to show people around you what you were actually drinking. Doing this is part of a kind of tradition in this country. In addition, there is a tradition of shoes and slippers in this country. If there is a slipper or shoe upside down on the road, at home or in the office, it has to be done without anyone's understanding. Because reverse slippers are considered the biggest bad omen in Lebanon. If you don't do this, the people of Lebanon can be angry with you. In Lebanon, guests are greeted as a greeting. If you don't do this, you will be considered an uncivilized and angry person. If there is a party in a family, it doesn't matter that there are 5 or 50 people in that room. If you are going inside, you will have to greet each one of them. If someone is too special, people kiss his cheek three times from the side. If you are sitting next to a person in this country, don't put your foot next to him. The people of Lebanon get angry with this thing as soon as possible. In the tradition of Lebanon, it is considered wrong to step towards another. But this is not the case in Lebanon. Customers who come to the shops here are welcomed by saying Khalliha Alena. Some elderly people living here still believe in a strange tradition. When a traditional Arab is drinking coffee from a cup, the cup accidentally falls on the ground. So the person has to pick up the cup and throw it back on the ground and break. Because people here believe that the bad cup remains inside the house. In fact, friends, Lebanon is a very amazing country. Mount Lebanon is a mountain range in Lebanon, which is 2,500 meters above sea level. The name of the country actually comes from this mountain range. The longest river in Lebanon is the Litani River, which is about 140 kilometers long. Almost all the major cities in Lebanon are located around this river. Friends, Lebanon has a pleasant weather all year round. But it is said that if you want to travel in this country, November in. Because you may have to pay the price for it. In fact, if someone in Lebanon decides to commit suicide by throwing himself from a roof or a building, then he falls on someone's car and the owner of the car is punished for it. Although this is a bit strange, but this is the law of Lebanon. In addition, there is a law in this country that should be in every country. Under this law, if someone in Lebanon marries Vikram after raping, then he is not punished. Here women are not allowed to wear swimsuits on the beaches. Nor can women wear skirts and shorts on the beaches of Lebanon. In addition, in 1945, after a law was passed, no human being can wave the flag of any other country. Now let's tell you what is the visa process here and how much money you will have to spend to travel in Lebanon. Let me tell you that if you have all the documents, you will get the visa in about 30 days. If you are alone, then you will have to spend about 80,000 to 95,000 rupees to travel Lebanon in 7 to 8 days. Friends, Lebanon's currency is Lebanese pound and about 20 Lebanese pound is equal to 1 Indian rupee. How did you like it? Tell us in the comments. Have you ever visited this country and if you have, then share with us how was your experience. I hope you liked this episode. Like the video and don't forget to share it with your friends and relatives. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching the video till the end. See you in the next video. Thank you.